Welcome to our introduction to Windows XP. In this video, we'll add shortcuts to the desktop. In this video, I'm going to show you how to add shortcuts to the desktop. By default, you may just have a few. It depends on where you purchased your computer or who owned the computer before you did as to how many icons you're going to have on the desktop. I have mine quite tidy at the moment, just my computer and recycle bin, but often when you buy a computer now, you find a lot of icons on the desktop because a lot of computers already have a great deal of software installed, and those pieces of software have icons on the desktop. So, how do you add more icons? Well, one is as easy as go to the Start menu and go to All Programs. You choose, you don't click at all, you just move your mouse around until you get where you want to go. Let's say I want to go to Games, to the Games folder, the Games menu, and let's say I want to add Internet Checkers to my desktop. So what you do, and again I haven't clicked on anything at all except the Start button here, but I haven't clicked since then. Okay, Internet Checkers. What you can do is right-click. Okay, I'm right-clicking even though it doesn't look any different. I'm right-clicking and holding the right mouse button down. And now I drag so the mouse is over the desktop. And now you see the Start menu disappears. And I can now move this to where I want. And then if I let go of the right mouse button, do I want to copy, move here, or cancel? Generally, you want to copy the shortcut or cancel in case you changed your mind. So let's left click copy. And there we go. I've just created a shortcut for internet checkers. If I want to open that, I just left click it twice, click click, and it opens. And okay, that's how it looks. But I'm not going to play now. But that's all it takes to set up the shortcut on the desktop. So let's quit that. And let's go back to the Start menu, All Programs, and we can add as many as we want. If I want to add iTunes, just hold the mouse over it, right-click, drag without letting go of the right mouse button, the Start menu disappears, and let's put it here, let go of the right mouse button, and left-click on Copy, If I want to move that, I just click the left mouse button, drag, and let go. So that's how you add shortcuts to the desktop to make it a lot quicker and easier to access the software you want to.